Hello there, it's Waddle1876, and you're here with a new update in Build a Boat for Treasure. I did want to do something that I did previously. And that thing I did previously was go through the top 10 Chill Studio Hall of Fame um, things. The top, like, top recent ones. Um, and I'll just like give my general idea on them. I don't know how many I'm doing, I just started basically to like a week ago? Yeah, like a week ago. Um, and I'm going from there, so I do hope you guys enjoy here. See, it is fun to do these things. I mean, some of you may not like, you may not full on like the, uh, the, the review of the Hall of Fame, but I think it's kind of nice and it gives me content. Okay, here we are. So, the first build I found was Subu Sabie Gundam, and it seems like it's a mech type build that has a double wielding sword and wing like objects on the back of it. It reminds me of like um, Transformers in a way because it's like metallic like nature and like I don't know you, you can probably see what I mean it is very robotic and nice looking. Aesthetically it is very nice to look at and it reminds me of like a samurai. Uh, I don't know what Sabi Gundam means in any other language, but it could mean mech. Or it could mean something completely random. Here's a small build by Lo um, by Me Name Shock called Lockhead Martin F22 Ra Raptor. Yeah, Raptor. This one looks like it wasn't built in Build a Boat for Treasure because of how detailed it is. It looks like it was built in like Blender or it was in some other game. It's insane how detailed this is. It made in Build a Boat entirely. This one's smaller, but still pretty amazing. Um, it's a tow truck. And it has a couple of loads. And each one of these cars actually has complete detail. So as you can see, the um, cars in these have a steering wheel and like everything attached to it. Uh, here's the inside of one. It has even like, <laughs> it has the mirrors that look on the back. Side view mirrors, it has a radio, it has a steering wheel. It has the clutch, it has the, all those things. It's insane! I honestly can't believe it. These are amazing. I find One thing I find funny is that there you can see the American flag and we get a reaction of the British flag. This is, this is the 2018 McLaren Senna, which is a very nice looking car. Um, it looks very modern. It looks like some kind of thing I'd see on a car show, honestly. Uh, it does not look like it was made in Build a Book of Treasure. I mean, look at the detail. These headlights look insane. The spoiler looks insane. Again, everything about this is just lovely. This is the Underworld by Fernando. And this one's not a car or anything like that. It is honestly a really nice looking build. And the way he did the chains are amazing because that looks like it took hours to make. And this is not like a car or a tow truck, it is an actual underworld with a dragon. This is the entire build, little eye goblins and stuff. It just looks amazing. Honestly, I would want to review that in person because that looks amazing. Here we have Obese Iowa, a ship that has tons of detail. Um, this one's a little blurry, but it looks like it has insane amounts of deep, insane amounts of deep. It looks like it has an insane amount of detail in it. And it is honestly huge. This one would have had to be built vertically to supply the amount of area it is. This is one of those builds you, you can't really build with the building scaling tool. And I gotta give props to the person who made this because this is amazing. Here's a top view from it, and you can just see the insane amount of like size it is. <clears throat> 
This is another simple one. It's the T90 MS tank for orbiting witches. It's a nice small one, but it's a very simple, nice tank. It's made to blend it with the sand, camouflage, etc., etc. You know how war works. This is another one that reminds me of like um, Autobots and Decepticons, all that stuff, um, Transformers. It is another one like the one in the beginning. It has a nice sword, it has wings, and Oh, this reminds me of Transformers. Uh, this is another car called the Citron Servot by Den Roblox, which looks amazing. It reminds me of the Lion Racer games, if you've ever heard of those. Um, that's kind of what it looks like. And it's really cool. It reminds me of like, uh, the aesthetic's nice. And you can see you can't see it out, but it, the inside is very detailed. The aesthetic chosen is so makes it so you can't see out, but I think that's worth it. We have another car, the Lamborghini Aventor SVG by Salty, um, which is another car, good, amazing build that, honestly, the people in Roblox in this game who make car builds are just insane. How do you have this much time? Oh my gosh, this looks like it's real. Okay, I just decided to look it up online, and oh my gosh, the similarities are just insane. I'm going to give you like a side-by-side -side comparison probably or something, but look, that is just crazy how similar they look. Yes, the coloring's different, but that's completely based on how a person wants to make it. The headlights look the same. I'm just trying to pick out things that don't look similar at this point because it's honestly amazing. It has the, like, the air vent thing, I don't know what it's called. Uh, it even has a logo on the back panel. Oh my gosh, this person is dedicated beyond all belief. And our last one for today is another mech, but it's another it's a mech where it's like humanoid controlled mech. Which I think is a really nice like idea. Um reminds me of Transformers again, but like if it took place in the jungle because of the colors. Um more like paler colors. No, the sand. It, Take place, I don't know. You know, I don't know. Desert City. Who cares? Um, but no, this is another really nice build. Um, it's more steampunky, I got it, if I were to describe it, but it still has the nice look to it. There you go, I'm the hundredth reaction to it. Anyway, I do hope you enjoy this. Um, you're probably wondering why did I change my skin to the new skin. That's because I felt like it, and you can't judge me based on what I choose my skin to be. Um, I decided to be benevolent today and Why didn't Fusion join the game? Hello, Caitlin. Anyway, I decided to be benevolent today, and I'm going to gift someone randomly inside the game. So I'm going to choose maybe meh. And they are going to be getting 50 gold. There you go. I hope you enjoy your 50 gold. I'm going to be doing that more often than not, and um, I do hope that, uh, you know, Helps, helps uh, bring in new people because, hey, everyone needs a little bit of gold. Never going to turn down some gold. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this, please consider liking. There is a good chunk of you who aren't subscribed right now. Like, only like 2% of you are actually subscribed. I can't believe you would disown, disobey me like this. I mean, I feel hurt. But anyway, um, yeah. Comment your name. I don't know. Maybe I'll give 50 gold to someone. I don't know. Wait, maybe. Who knows? But hey, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next video. Have a nice day. See ya!